Hey family, much love to you all. I hope all is well with many of you. I'm not going to hold you that long. I just wanted to share something with many of you. Now, many of you know, not only do I have this channel, but I also have a backup channel. It's called Weekend Butterfly Readings. And with that channel, I've pretty much been exercising my gift of the spirit that I have came into. I truly believe I always had it, but it was doormatted. But once I came into my, you know, spiritual awakening and I had a Kundalini, I feel like it quickened my spirit to where, you know, my gift of the spirit started to come to the forefront, shall I say. And I was aware of it. I, I became more conscious. My conscious, you know, my awareness had increased and um, I became real sensitive. And all of this has played a big part as far as how uh, I've been able to come to a place of knowing. Now, with that being said, according to the word, you know, it speaks about, you know, um, how the, more, the most high God, how source give his children, you know, um, gifts. Okay, because everybody have a gift and talent. And when we use these gifts, we are given more gifts and talents. Many people, they don't use them at all and they lose them. How do you say you either use it or you lose it? Okay. But anyway, the point I'm trying to make is when I start to exercise using my gift, not only you know was I using it at first for myself, okay, testing it out, testing the waters, I was using it for myself, and I realized, wow, you know, this has really been in my favor. It is truly helping me to navigate within as well as without out here in this earthly realm, out here in this matrix. Not only that, it helps to me to be in a state of knowing to where I'm not being played and I see things for what it really is. Okay? It's, it's like an aha moment. It's like, you know, where was this back in the day, you know, when I really, really could have used it? But it's a time for everything. I'm just grateful that I've been allowed to have this experience and to use it for my highest good and the highest good of others. So, I went from using my gifts of the spirit of knowing, not only applying it for myself, but also, you know, uh, being a service to my brothers and sisters, you know, um, like doing readings and all of this. And then I went a little step further, okay, because I have a backup channel, Awakened Butterfly Readings. I went a little step further. I said, you know what, um, there's a lot of information I have been coming in, you know, coming into, shall I say. And, you know, I'm I'm also connected with my higher self. And I know, you know, when I'm allowed to speak on certain topics and when I'm not allowed to. Because everything is not for everybody. A lot of information is for me to know, okay? But if I get the green light, be okay, I will share certain information. So I started to, you know... Go ahead and do some predictions, all right? And then I so I did a prediction two months ago about Trump. And wow, I couldn't believe the information that was coming out, all right? According to that prediction that I did, it was stating that Trump was going to lose the election. Okay, then of course I did another reading a while back and it was saying that you know he really did um you know, as far as him losing the election, it was due to fraud. I mean, it was. The Spirit let me know this, all right? But the point is, a lot of people was really hoping that he would win, okay? And they knew that fraud can be, to play a big factor, but they was really hoping that he would win this election. And you know what? <sighs> Normally, when I'm led by the Spirit, it is what it is. You know, I accept, I accept it because this is my truth. You know, I'm, I'm receiving this information from within, all right? Because I'm connected with my high, because I am connected with my high, with my, with my I am present, okay? So, a lot of times when I get information, you know, I receive it, okay? And I don't doubt it. But I was watching this other channel, and I'm not going to say the name, okay? Because I'm not here to bash no other channel. I still like the channel, to tell you the truth. But the point I'm trying to make is, I was watching a particular channel, and it's this guy, we have this woman on, on there with him. 
And, you know, I respect the brother and I respect the, and I respect the sister. You know, um, everybody has their own, you know, opinions. And I respect everyone's opinion. This is not a communist country, you know. It's getting to where everybody's so sensitive, we can't say anything, you know. But when people say things I don't agree with, you know, I'm like, okay, well, that's their opinion. You know, I got my own opinion, but I'm not going to leave a, a negative comment. You know, there's a lot of things that the brother was saying and the woman was saying. You know, I agree with. And then there's a lot of things that, you know, was said on that channel I didn't agree with. Okay? I pretty much just took that which resonated and that which didn't. You know? Like, like how they say it was going one year, not the other. The point I'm trying to make is, it was a lot of things that was said as far as, you know, um, you know, no matter what it looks like, Trump is going to win. So I, start, I got to where I started questioning my own gifts. I was like... Well, you know, maybe I'm wrong, you know, maybe, you know, Trump is going to win this election, you know. The point I'm trying to make is you get to where you start to question yourself, and that's something that you should not do, family. We all have this gift. It's a spiritual muscle. It's a matter of, you know, exercising it. I want to change um, rooms. Hold on, family. All right, family, this is the video I was talking about right here, okay? As you see, I did this video two months ago, right here. Alright family, so anyway, as you see I did that video like two months ago. Actually it's going on three months to tell you the truth, but anyway. And so, I believed in myself enough and my gifts and talents, you know, of what I was picking up in the spirit and I wanted to share it, okay? You know, if it comes to fruition, fine. If it don't, oh well, all right? But at least I stepped out. I stepped out in faith, and I just acted on on what I was believing, okay, as far as what I was picking up being led by the Spirit. So anyway, um, but the channel that I was looking at, you know, they was like, you know, pro-Trump, pro-Trump, and, you know, I'm not saying I'm like pro-Trump, pro-Trump, but let me tell you this, I'm definitely not pro-Biden, okay? Let me just say that, okay? Um, none of them are perfect, let me just say that. Um, but I would prefer Trump being up in there than Biden. That's all I'm going to say, but, you know, we know that Trump is not perfect either. Either they all have their agendas, let me just say that. I just feel like Trump would have been more better suited than Biden, but it is what it is, okay? And so it was like a raging inner battle within me because, you know, carnally, mentally, you know, I was, you know, rooting for Trump. I'm just going to keep it real with you, okay? And, but the Spirit was telling me something totally different, okay? Uh, I did a reading and, and I got Trump and I, and I still was questioning myself. And then I did a prediction, still got Trump, okay? And I knew the factors behind it, you know, uh, why it would end up being Trump. And like I said, maybe you decide to check that video out. Feel, please feel free to do so, okay? But it has a lot to do with the snakes, okay? The wolves that are the world around him, okay? But he couldn't see it because he's not spiritual whatsoever. And he was not operating in his divine intuition had he been. Uh, I'm sure he has an advisor, but whoever, whomever his advisor was, let me just say that... <sighs> sheep and wolf, wolf clothing, let me just say that, they wasn't really advising him properly, not not at all, okay? But anyway, um, the point I'm trying to make is I was really wrestling because I was going by what that channel was saying, forgetting all about operating in my divine intuition, what is this telling me on the inside? I got sidetracked big time, okay? And it's easily get sidetracked when you're looking outside of yourself, Okay, just like many of you watching me, I know you got love for your sister, but I always say, I always say, go within, don't I? I never say take my word but for anything. I say, go within, family. I tell many of you this every time I do a video, I say, go within, okay? Seek confirmation. Seek clarity. Go within. Because can nobody tell you the truth like you can, okay? Especially what you're picking up on the inside, you know? Um, you have to, you know... 
get that for yourself. Let me just say that. But you can seek clarity. And now I say there's confirmation when somebody's speaking something and you resonate with that you can, but you still need to get to that place of being led by your own spirit, right? Things will start to, you know, synchronize and everything when you start to hook up with other people. You know, you will get that because the universe is going to lead to the right people at the right time, you know. So you will get validation or, or should I say confirmation, but still be led by the spirit, not mental. It's not what you think now. What is this telling you? But I got sidetracked, you know. I was going by what I thought versus the spirit, and it, it doesn't mix. It does not mix. Let me just tell you that right now. It's what this is on the inside, Okay. And so, as I stated, you know, I was going back what they were saying, and I was like, well, you know, I, I guess, you know, maybe, I'm saying this to myself, I, I guess maybe I am wrong, you know, maybe, you know, I, I misunderstood what the Spirit was saying, you know, blah, 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 you know. So, got closer and closer, and, you know, even when Trump was, you know, trying to fight, you know, uh, as far as trying to, you know, stay in the race, you know, um, try to fight this, um, according to him, you know, um, you know, as far as Trump's concerned, you know, uh, they was trying to bamboozle him with the election, and they did, they really did, but it wasn't in his favor. It was not in his favor. And a little after, you know, the election, I felt a, I felt a shift, and I think I did a video a while, a while back, I'll tell you many of you of this, I said I felt some kind of shift in the atmosphere. I could put my hand on it, but I felt a shift. I felt a shift. And I was like, mm. it's like something was just different in the atmosphere. Something was just different. But the point I'm trying to make is, family, um, please rely on your intuition. It doesn't matter what I say. It doesn't, it doesn't matter what other, others say. What is this on the inside is telling you? I always tell many, many of you this all the time. But I still have to keep myself in check because I can get caught off guard. You know, yeah, people I might say a lot of things. It might sound good and all, but please still go by what is this telling you on the inside. Because at the end of the day, nothing's going to affect you if you don't receive it. If you don't receive it, it's not going to affect you. Just like uh, watching a lot of people who, who are a lot of people, oh my goodness, a lot of people are so discouraged now because Trump didn't win. But not just that, it, it, I guess it's just something in the air and people are just feeling very discouraged. They're feeling depressed, you know. And plus a lot of people watching a lot of these gloom and doom and apocalyptic videos. And all of this doing is lowering their vibration, okay. But it's doing all of this because they are receiving it. They're receiving it. So that's why it's lowering their vibration, okay? And we know that's a no-no. All you're doing is feeding the beast. You know, you're feeding these low vibrational, you know, vampires, uh, disembodied spirits and entities. You know, they love that. That's And the, and the media show loves it because they're giving us a whole lot of fake news. They're not really telling us what's really, really going on. But this will tell you if you rely on it. This will, this will, you know, this wish. This would navigate you in this earthly realm as well as within, okay? And I should have known this being navigate me all along when I go within myself. I'm never attacked. I'm never attacked when I go within myself. I might see things, but I know how to handle it. It's what you do at the end of the day. It's what you do that determines everything, even within yourself. Are you going to go in fear mode because you see something you don't understand? Or, or it's how you handle it. Or are you going to see it with love? It doesn't care for your love, and it sure as hell don't care for your light. It's going to disappear and fade out. It's what you do. But the point I'm trying to make is operate your divine intuition.